morena kaba, pero gusto ng pumute. Gusto ng pumute, pero kapos sa budget. No worries, mga kabayan. Home remedies. Sagot sa kahirapan. Hello, mga kabayan. Welcome sa Pinay Abroad Vlog. The Kabayan Vlog version 2.0. If you're new to my channel, please click like and subscribe below. For today's video, I'm gonna show you how my skin lightens. So, take note guys, lighten lang kasi hindi naman talaga ako mapute, hindi ako cleaner. So, this is uh, how, what I practice on how I lighten my skin. Kasi morena naman talaga ako. Morena talaga ako. As in, morena talaga ako. But, um, compared to like few years before or even few months before, it's way too much darker talaga. Yung mga kakilala ko, yung sino mo yung kakilala sa akin. Saksi sila sa aking kaidiman. Diba guys? Diba? Diba? Alam niyo kung gano'n ko kaitin before. Tapos ang kamay. But, um, so yun na nga. I've tried too many things. Too many. Nakagastos na din ako ng mga madami-dami na din. So, I've tried gluta capsules, gluta soaps, and even like yung injection ng gluta thion na nakakaubos ng pera. But, it's, I think it's effective. But, for those people na um, walang budget sa pagpapapute. Katulad kong OFW na sakto lang, sakto sakto lang din ang kita. It's better to practice like home remedies. So, so yung mga nakakilala sa akin, alam nila yan kung gano'n ko kaitin before. But, for you na hindi talaga nakakakilala sa akin, para maniwala kayo, let's watch this video. drama mga besh. Grabe ang itim ko before. So for today, I'm gonna show you na nga mga secrets, no? Wait. First, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you how I did my this scrub. So our ingredients are coffee, coffee scrub. Ito yung residue ng coffee maker. So ganyan siya, guys. And then uh, olive oil. Yung mas maganda yung extra virgin olive oil. So yun siya. Tapos mixing bowl. I-mix mo lang siya. So, ito yung ginagamit ko pang scrub. Sa body and face. Konting olive oil lang. Wala tayo yung spoon. So, ganyan lang siya. Hanggang sa mag-ganito lang siya na paste. Parang paste lang siya. So as you can see, I uh, mainly focus on my forehead because if you notice that my forehead is way too darker compared to my face. So I'm going to take a look at my face. 
so I if you are going to scrub for your face if it's better kung uh, medyo light lang siya kasi our face is very sensitive compared to the body so ganun lang siya guys and you can scrub it for at least like maybe two minutes so for me as I've mentioned I focus on my forehead kasi ang itim niya guys Grabe. ang itim ng forehead ko so aside from my face this is what I use as well to my body. So every once a week, yan siya, guys. So first is you need to exfoliate to remove the dead skin. It is best to exfoliate every once a week. So ito na nga, di ba? Ito na yung bare, bare face ko. Second step is I use this um, like uh, bath soap, bath soap, soap, bath soap. So na sintol. Flavor is lime. Commercial one. So, what for the scrub and the for the scrub and the soap? This is what I use for my body as well. So, tignan nyo naman. Like compared to who this could be for, de ba? So the third step is to cleanse your face kasi nga sa sabon minsan naman hindi nakukuha lahat so hindi nagamit ko ito ito siya so this one is a combination of um, rose water half of rose water and half is apple cider vinegar so meron na lang to sa Pinas Apple cider vinegar. So I use bread because it's the pinaka effective. Apple cider vinegar. Sabi nila, apple cider is uh, like effective siya to even out the skin. And then rose water, it uh, cleans out the oiliness or it it helps the to the oiliness of your skin. So mag English una mag English. Mag Tagalog na alam ko. So yun na nga. First thing you need to do is exfoliate kasi nga may mga dead skin and dry skin na kailangan tanggalin sa skin mo. And then next, next step is um, you need to uh, like wash your face with the your preferred soap. Hindi naman necessary siguro yung, siguro yung sintol or ano kasi wala naman natin yun sa Pinas. Check nyo kung meron sa Pinas. And then third is um, you have to cleanse your face, especially your face. Kasi may mga, may mga dirt, may mga, mga dirt na hindi natatanggal ng soap, ng, ng soap. So, and even pag sa scrub. So, yun. And then the fourth thing is, if you exfoliate your skin, ang tendency, that tendency is it will be like very dry. So, you need to, fourth is, moisturize. So you need to moisturize your face with your preferred moisturizer. So for me, what I use is yung Ole. Ole siya. And then hindi lang siya basta Ole. Ano ba yan? Hindi na po focus. Hindi lang siya basta Ole kasi yung Ole ko, nilalagyan ko siya na. Tada! Extra virgin olive oil. May olive oil naman sa Pinas. Or yung coconut oil, it's okay. 
moisturize you know? it will add moisture to your face To moisturize my body, kasi hindi lang nagsascrub din ako sa, sa body ko, di ba? So, ang ginagamit ko is yung Vaseline. But, again, nilalagyan ko siya ng olive oil to moisture for my body. Kasi na, hindi siya ano. So, ginaganan ko lang siya yung Vaseline. Tsaka, ina-apply ko siya directly to my skin. So that's it guys, hindi uh, necessary na mahal magpapute or kailangan gumasas ng thousands para maglighten yung skin mo. Those are just some of the home remedies that I practice at home. And then so far it's very effective. So if you have any other comments or any practices that you practice at home, please leave a comment below. And see you next time!